What's up, YouTube? Round 323 Gaming Care making me another video. In today's video, we're going to be continuing on with Madden 2005 European Football League. Um, Before I start, I hope you like, hope you comment, and hope you subscribe to this channel. Just a short video today. We're just going to be checking out the stats and shit like that. And yeah, so Brackens. Mike Brackens obviously leads the league in pass rating with Marty Simpson's number two. Marty Simpson and Mike Brackens are the top two quarterbacks in the league, but Bobby Wilson got 2,000 pass yards for now. But he leads the league in touchdowns, obviously, out of those amazing two games. But Simpson's right behind that nigga, though, as you can see. And he got the few amount of interceptions. This nigga should definitely be an MVP candidate. I don't care what you niggas gotta say, man. He should definitely be an MVP candidate, man. You know what I mean? But he leads in completion percentage. Simpson. So, yeah. You know what I mean? So, that's really it, though. But here are some other stats that I really don't give a fuck about, to be honest with you. Um, we're reaching towards... We're in the half, second half of the season two of this shit. And so far, season two has been pretty good. Pretty amazing for the most part. I definitely enjoyed it more than season one so far. With the storylines, with the Wolfsburg and Milan basically taking over the league and shit like that. It's just been so fun to watch. And you know what I mean? Like, I've never so far in the Madden series, because usually like in the Madden Trope series, it was always one quarterback that was going against the MVP for a run. It was usually one quarterback. But for the first time, it's two quarterbacks who is MVP candidates. And I'm going to say this, man. I mean, shit. It's, I feel like, I don't know, man. Like, whoever plays well down the stretch, obviously going to win MVP. But it's like, I ain't going to lie, man. Top two quarterbacks that's trying to get the revenge. You love to see it, man. So now we're going to, I ain't edit none of this shit out, so yeah i just didn't feel like it because i mean it's a friday i just want to get this video out by saturday so i'm not gonna edit none of this bullshit out which meh, it is what it is i'm trying to see where the hell do i go like where the hell is like um yeah the, the newspaper i guess so yearly awards look who it is at number one mike brackens undefeated Goat, but look who's number two, Martin Simpson. Top two quarterbacks in the league, top two players in the league, bro. Those motherfuckers are built different, bro. I will say that for the most part. Those motherfuckers are built different. Honestly, I we could consider those co MVPs. And look at this first offensive player of the year, bro. Burnside's number three, though. But man, you know who it is right now. Defensive player is Hayes, obviously, but do we care? Uh uh, we don't care. Sorry, I had to yawn, bro. Rookie of the year, so these are the rookies, mainly by receivers for the most part, so yeah, it is what it is. Defensive rookie of the year um, is Spencer and other defensive players for the most part, so here you go. And then best quarterback, where's Mike Brackens? That's weird. That's weird. Uh, some of this shit is weird. So this is what's going to happen. If Mike Brackens is not part of the best quarterback award, does that mean he's not a first team all pro? That's basically what it is. So we're going to get Mars Simpson the first team all pro. If Mars Simpson going to win the first team all pro and Mike Brackens going to win MVP, then fuck it. We're going to have two co-MVPs, basically. Because, I mean, shit. What the fuck is this? <laughs> what the hell? You know what I mean? Listen, man. We will see what's up with these guys. We will see. But for the most part, man. Um, I'm ready and I'm very excited. What's going to happen for the next few videos of the Madden series, obviously. Obviously, the next video won't come back until... Since it's Saturday. Probably, oh, it's a holiday weekend next week. 
Huh. Not this week. It'll be Saturday. But next Saturday, Memorial Day weekend. So, I'm definitely making no videos. So, when I'm going to come back? Hmm. Because obviously, I got to make the shorts and shit. I'll see. I'll see. I'll see. But, here are the horse trailer players of the week. Um, Bobby Lane was week one. Then Willie was week two. Who have a good game? Then Rojas was week threes and then thomas with weeks four all defensive players week five was grant week six was kalowski week seven was my nigga mike brackens for that one game in overtime then kevin westbrook doing this shit all right so now it is time to look at the mother freaking standings all right you know what i mean all right, man. Let's look at the standings, my nigga. Come, ah, man. This is what happens when you don't edit shit, huh? Oh, the eat or so Milan is number one. They're the only undefeated team left, but the Wolves is right behind them though, and Barcelona too. And then you got the Lions, the Persians. So the French teams, the French division is low key going crazy, except for Monaco though. Persians is one game out in the Wolves, in the Bats, and that's really it for the most part. The worst, ooh, 0-8? Oh Jesus Christ, Madrid is just terrible, bro. Both Madrid teams has their bottom as well. And then the Eagles are 6-1, and one, and the Gunners are 5-2. and two. Then you got the Lions, the Reds, the Blues, the Farmers and shit. And yeah, man. All right, then. So... Ooh, okay, this, 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 okay, so the NFC is a lot more competitive with these teams, but still. So Milan and the Wolves are battling for the Italian division, even though the Devils swept them, so it doesn't matter. The France is kind of tight right now. Monaco ain't done just yet. They just got to win a couple games. The Wolves so far, somewhat comfortable, somewhat, against the Persians and the Stars, by the way. Barcelona, they're going to play the next week, so. Or next game, I guess. Or next video. The Gunners and the Blues are still battling out for the English division. And then the Reds battling out for the Belgium division. And then the Portugal. No. Yeah, Portugal division. And then you got the Dutch division. So that's going to do for this video. Like, comment, subscribe. See you later.